T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lift off, lift off for 9. Avionics, telemetry, and power, look healthy. Plus one minute and 17 seconds into flight. You've heard the call out. Falcon 9 performance is nominal as we head downrange over the Pacific Ocean, flying south from the launch site at Vandenberg Air Force Base in California. We're passing through the region of maximum dynamic pressure right now. This is where the high pressure of the atmosphere combines with the speed of the rocket to provide the greatest stresses on the Falcon 9 vehicle. We throttle the engines down as we pass through this phase and throttle them back up as we proceed on into orbit. The major activity coming up will be main engine cutoff at T plus two minutes and 25 seconds. We'll listen for that, followed shortly after by stage separation and then ignition of the second stage engine. Let's listen in as the Falcon 9 continues to head downrange, preparing for shutdown of the first stage and stage separation and ignition of the second stage. seconds into flight. We've had successful shutdown separation of the Falcon 9 first stage. The second stage engine is lit. You can see it there. We're coming up on three minutes as we head into low Earth orbit. Everything looking good. Avionics, telemetry, and power look healthy. Stage one has entered its flip. Stage two propulsion is nominal. Stations proceed to procedure 7.101 on orbit activation deployment. Stage one boost back is starting. Stage two propulsion is nominal. Stage one boost back is shut down.
Mission A, first swap to Omni C, Grand Omni B, Force On, Bitmap 20, commands published, CC verify and lock. CC verifies, command request 1, S band transmitted. Stage 2 propulsion is nominal. Locked. Sending. Permit acquisition of signal. Second stage continuing to head downrange as we go into what will be the first of two orbits, the low Earth orbit, followed by a coast phase, then a reignition of the second stage engine later on this morning to get the 10 Iridium satellites into their final orbit. Now currently you can see the nozzle, well you can't see the nozzle of the second stage because we're showing you the first stage right now. Grid fins are deployed. We're coming up on the next first stage event, which will be in about 17 seconds, which is beginning of the entry burn, which will then be followed shortly after that by the landing burn. On the right, you can see the second stage engine nozzle. That's currently glowing red. That's typical for the upper stage engine. Everything's looking good right now. Give me a second. Let me see how things are going on the first stage. And we're coming up on the engines. We have boost back going. You can hear the applause in the background from the SpaceX team gathered around the Mission Control Center as we're watching the three Merlin engines on the first stage light. And we have got shutdown for the boost back burn. So currently we're coming up on T plus seven minutes. Second stage continues to head into orbit. First stage is coming back to the drone ship. Let's go bound to the floor for the landing burn and the entry into orbit of the second stage. So as you just saw, the uh, re-entry burn for the first stage has just completed and looks successful. Uh, you can still see camera footage from the first stage descending down. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to maintain video all the way down to the drone ship. What a great shot that is, it's beautiful. Now, so as you know, sometimes we lose that video in the drone ship, there's a lot of vibrations happening there. Um, we're gonna try our best to keep that link and hopefully once that landing burn hits, we'll catch it, we'll see it visually. And if all goes well, Falcon 9 will be standing proud there on the deck of our drone ship. Uh, you may have noticed little puffs of uh, what looked like smoke coming out from between the grid fins every once in a while. Um, those are part of the attitude control system. Uh, I, I think this is the, the, the landing burn. It looks like the landing burn has just started, uh, so we should be coming right down on the deck of Just Read the Instructions. Uh, this is a single engine landing burn, so it's a, a slower uh, decrease in speed. Wow. You can uh, actually see the deck of the drone ship right now. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> plus nine minutes and 14 seconds, and we have just shut down the second stage engine. Falcon 9 second stage carrying 10 Iridium satellites has gone into the parking orbit. You also heard the cheering and you saw as we actually saw the first stage come all the way back to the drone ship. Didn't have the video dropouts like we've had in the past. We're currently pressurizing the stage, settling the propellants down near the engine. And at about uh, 10 seconds or so, we should have ignition. So we're gonna listen in right now for a very short burn, just a few seconds, of the upper stage engine. The deck shut down. Looks like we've got a uh, good orbit for putting the second stage into. This will now initiate the beginning of a lengthy sequence where we're separating the 10 Iridium satellites from the SpaceX dispenser that's mounted up on top of the second stage. Now we're about seven minutes away from that sequence.